What up, people? This your boy Vagabond here to give you my thoughts on Hajime no Ippo Rising, episode 4. Now, I thought this was a good episode. You know, a lot of comedy relief. You know, I thought it was one of those classic Ippo episodes where you get that comedy relief that just makes you laugh from some of these characters. And you, we got it in this particular episode. Of course, you know, this episode, it consists a lot of Aoki and his um, challenger, um, Aman, or Aima. But, um, yeah, man, it was a solid episode. I wish, now, I wish they could have got to the fight quicker. You know, I felt like they dragged that out a little bit, but I wish they could have got to that fight quicker. But, uh, overall, man, this was a solid episode. Now, what happened in the episode is, you know, we leave off from the way in, and, um, we see Aoki there. He's naked or whatever. Dick showing and all that, man. And his opponent, man, he's like, what the hell is wrong with you, man? Like, what are you doing, dog? And, you know, Aoki, he's trying to explain to him that, yo, man, I, can, I just had to take my draws off so I can make weight a little bit. And, you know, that's not uncommon in boxing. Like, some fighters, they do have to take their, um, you know, their underwears or boxers off just so they can take that little one inch, you know, that, that little pound and a half or whatever off. Well, at least a quarter of a pound, whatever you want to fucking call it. But, um, yeah, man, I thought that was particularly funny. You know, Aoki, his fighter, the fighter that he's going against, he's a very serious fighter. I mean, in the episode, he actually, there was a little bit of a conversation between him and his girlfriend. And his girlfriend was trying to give him food because, you know, he made weight and everything. So, usually after you make weight, you want to rehydrate, eat, drink, or whatever. And um, he's like just totally like off-putting with his girlfriend. He basically said, "Get the fuck away from me!" Like he's like he basically saying that you know he was telling her that you know I dumped you so I can dedicate myself to boxing. Like I don't want you around me. So you know this fighter that Aoki is going against, he's a very serious fighter. And um, yeah. And then you know Aoki later on, he's chilling in his bedroom with his girl, and he actually has sex in the bedroom with her. And I was tripping out. I was like, holy shit, man. This nigga, I know he just didn't have sex with her. Because you know, in boxing, when when you got a fight coming up, that's one thing you don't want to do. You don't want to have sex with it. You don't want to have sex, you know, with your girlfriend. You know, especially a day after the, before the fight happens, you just don't want to have sex. Because it could definitely ruin your stamina or, you know, going into that ring. Like, that's just a... That's just a fucking no-no. You can't do it. Like, even in real boxing, you can't have sex, you know, before you fight. Because it really ruins your stamina in the ring. So, um, you know, I thought that was kind of funny, though, man. You know, his, um, Takamura and them, they asking him, you know, he comes to the, um, arena. And they're telling him, you know, he's all happy and cheerful. Because, you know, when you get that sex, man, when you get that putang, it's like... <laughs> You you be happy, man. You be happy than a mug. But um, yeah, he comes in the arena all happy, and he brings the girl with them, and they're all speculating. Like, Did you have sex with her? And then they were saying, you know, they didn't say nothing, but he's like, you idiot. And you know, they're just fucking whooping his ass or whatever. Talking about why'd you do that, man? You know that shit makes your stamina bad. But um, at the end of the episode, the two fighters they finally get in the ring. You got one fighter who's taking it very, very serious. And then you got Ioka who's very calm. Probably calmer than we ever seen him in the ring. And um, that's when the bell rings. And now they're they getting in the ring. Neither fighter is doing nothing, actually. Ioka, he's trying to, you know, dive in. But Aman, uh, Aman he's, he's just not doing nothing. He's just sitting there, sort of like calculating or whatever. But, um. And then the episode ends off like that, but, um, this was a good episode. I give it a 7 out of 10. You know, nice comedy relief, nice giggles and laughs or whatever if you got some of the jokes or whatnot. But, um, let me know what you think. Leave your comment, like this video, and I'll holler.